Ito, magmirienda ka muna. Salamat sa Diyos, ha. Kamusta na pala ang nanay mo? Ang nanay? Alberta! Hi, Dr. Blake. How are you? Thank you. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. How is Victoria? It seems like she's getting worse. Okay. Yeah. I know we've done some um, diagnostic tests with her. Let me explain it to you in my rooms in the clinic, okay? What's the bad news, Dr. Blake? I've got all the results of your mother. We have all the reasons to believe that she's got end-stage dementia. As I've explained before, dementia has no cure, meaning I would have to put her under palliative care. No. No. Palliative care would mean um, we're gonna stop all treatments for her. Yeah. All we can do now is to make her life as comfortable as possible, give her pain medications, give all the love and care that we could give her. Oh no. Yeah. And I'm sorry to tell but that's the best that we can do for now. Ito ang buhay ko sa Australia. Igisi ng maaga para maghanda papuntang trabaho. Paano ako nakarating dito? Mama ko ang kumuha sa akin. Actually, matagal niya akong kinukuha, pero di ma-approve-approve ang visa ko. Pero ngayon, nakuha na niya ako dahil nagkasakit siya. Pumayag na rin ang Australian government para may mag-alaga sa kanya. Kumuha ako ng trabaho bilang isang part-time dental assistant para may panggastos din. Pero, naging busy na dahil dumami na ang shift ko. Kaya di ko na masikap si Mama. Kaya last month, ipinasa ko na siya sa nursing home. Yun naman ang uso dito sa Australia. Hello. Hi, Alberta. How are you today? Uh, I'm calling in to inform you that uh, your mom requires additional clothes. Would you be able to bring for her when you come and visit next time? Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I will when I get the chance. Oh, that's good. Oh, by the way, uh, your mom was amazing today. She suddenly remembered you and wrote you a letter. Oh. Sorry, I've got another call. Thank you for calling me. Uy, Alberta, kamusta ka na? Uy, real! Long time no here. Free ka ba after work? Dinner naman tayo mamaya. Oo, oh, oh, free ako mamaya ang gabi. Saan tayo? Hello? Hi, Alberta. How is it going? I'm so sorry to inform you that your mom had a fall um, this morning. Oh, is she okay now? Oh, uh, is he all right? Fortunately, it was not major. She settled at least. Oh, that's good. Thank you for letting me know. Bye. Oh, oh, by the way, um, when are you coming next? I don't know. Uh, I'm busy. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I will let her know then. Hello. Hi, uh, this is Charmaine from Water Gardens Age Care. Is this Alberta? Yeah, yeah, this is Alberta. Hi, Alberta. I'm calling to inform you about your mom's upcoming appointment with the neurologist. It is on Thursday at 1 p.m. Your presence is required so the doctor can explain in detail. Okay, I'll, I'll be there. Alberta, it is really important that you come. You cannot miss this appointment this time. Okay, thanks. Um, see you on Thursday. Oh, by the way, um, don't forget the letter that your mom wrote for you before.
अलबेटा 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 हाँ यस लाइक व्हाट आई सेड वी हैव टू पुट योर माम अंडर पैलिटिव केयर डू यू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट आई एम ट्राइंग टू सेय अलबेटा यस आई अंडरस्टैंड डॉक्टर ब्लेक एंड इवन आई नोटिस दैट माय माम्स गुड डेज आर नॉट द सेम एस बिफोर This got me thinking of taking mom home and take care of her. I actually think that would be highly beneficial for her well-being. Um, we do have a lot of other options that will guide you or help you in the in order to take care of your mom. I have some um, pamphlets here. There you go. Is that so? Yes. Here are some information that you could access. Mahal kong Alberta, anak, hindi ko alam kung mababasa mo ang sulat na ito o di kaya ay maalala ko pa ang mga bagay na ito. Hindi ko rin alam kung kailan tayo muling magkikita o magkakausap, matanda at mahina na si nanay. Kaya hiling ko sana ang iyong pag-unawa at pagpapasinsya sa akin. Kapag may kaunti kang panahon, Magkwentuhan naman tayo kahit sandali. Alam kong busy ka sa trabaho anak. Nais kong malaman mo na sabik na sabik na akong makakwentuhan ka. Kahit alam kong hindi ka interesado sa aking mga kwento. Pagtiisan mo sana kung ako man ay maihi o madumi sa higaan. Patuloy mo sana akong pagtyagaan hanggang sa uling sandali ng aking buhay. At kapag dumating na ang oras na aking pagpanaw, Isipin mo na ako'y nagpapahinga lang. Huwag kang mangamba dahil kahit mawala man ako sa piling mo, ang Diyos naririyan pa rin.
Datapuat kung ang sino man ay hindi nagkakandili sa mga sariling kanya, lalong-lalo na sa kanyang sariling sangbahayan, ay tumanggi siya sa pananampalataya at lalong masama kaysa hindi sumasampalataya. Unang Timoteo 5.8